I've got notes! Hello everyone, hello friends! Um, can you tell that it's nighttime? Because it's definitely nighttime. My room, this light is just awful, and I painted it purple months ago. The setup is still a work in progress. Look, you can see my shadow on the wall. Isn't that distracting and fun? But look, my coworker made me this scrunchie. So much scrunchie for so little hair. But anyways, I was terrified of video stores and like video store, like Hollywood video, Blockbuster, family video. I was terrified of those places for one specific reason. And it's gonna be a story. So you gotta wait for the reason. So recently, um, Eddie Burback has been coming up on my For You page. So I've been binging all his videos, but he recently posted a video about Timmy the Tooth. And I almost thought for a minute that Timmy the Tooth was a fever dream of mine. And I recently Googled him before the video came out and I was like, there he is. And I was just like, wow, that, that was a thing. Timmy the Tooth was whack. Like definitely looked great during the experience of Timmy the Tooth. But if Timmy the Tooth ever came face to face with me in any situation outside of Timmy the Tooth, I would be terrified. But Timmy the Tooth wasn't the reason why I was scared of video stores, no sir. Video stores and my fear of video stores did bring me to Timmy the Tooth. When I was a kid, I was afraid of video stores for um, a reason that we'll get to in a minute because the reason still actually kind of terrifies me. I'm a baby. I'm gonna have to put the thing I'm terrified of in the video and I'm gonna have to look at it while editing so I'm gonna save that thing to the very end so I don't have to do it as much. Maybe I'm just gonna have to get over it for this video. Maybe, maybe. we'll see in the editing process. But as I was a child, I was in a Hollywood video in Newcastle, Pennsylvania, which is no longer there. I, could, I couldn't even tell you where it was. And I am crying and screaming and I have like my hands all covered up because I was scared of the thing that was in the Hollywood video. And literally my mom was like, ah, this poor child. And they could also purchase things at the Hollywood video. Like it wasn't just like a rental, you could also purchase videos. And for whatever reason, I saw the Timmy the Tooth birthday special, which just so happened to be what Eddie Burback talked about in his video. And I'm all like, I will not calm down if, unless you give me this Timmy the Tooth video so then I can look at something pleasant while I'm in like, you know, the video store. And my mom's like, all right, your siblings got the videos that they wanted to rent. She bought me the VHS tape of Timmy the Tooth and I went home with it and it was great. But my fear for video stores, like, I couldn't go in most of the time. And I'm gonna tell you why. So let me describe my like my activity when I would be fearful of these video stores. I'd either have my hands covered the whole time, I'd like hover the wall. If I needed someone in the store, I would like go up against the wall and I'd like crawl to them. I'd always be looking at the floor. Anyway, I was a mess in these video stores. And the reason why, and almost I think if there were video stores now, I'd probably still feel the same way. I almost don't want to say it. People are gonna make fun of me in the comments. I was terrified and still am to this day of the 1997 movie called Jack Frost. I have a terrible like sense of uncanny and looking at this snowman's face gave me nightmares for most of my life and maybe till still till this day. And it also goes along with fear of snowmen. <laughs> Some snowmen are fine. Snowmen that are shorter than me are fine. But oh my God, is Jack Frost the worst thing that I've ever set my eyes on. Like every single time it just gives me the heebie-jeebies. I can look at it normally now. I still have yet to watch the movie at all. One of these days I'm gonna have to because it's Michael Keaton <laughs> and I love Michael Keaton. He played Porco Russo. So one day, my very first time that I can recollect that um, I was going into, I was going into a family video and we were walking in and they had a huge poster for some reason because at this point it was probably like 2004 and it was a few years since the movie had came out of Jack Frost. Is that chocolate? No, that's just acne. Um, They had this huge poster of Jack Frost and like, like the middle of the store. Also, family videos were never very large. So then I'm like, why would you do that? So there he was just staring at me. And let me tell you, did I flip my lid? My parents were like, what the heck? And all my siblings were like, what's your problem? Anytime I saw Jack Frost, I correlated it with either library movie sections or video stores. Never would I go like any way or shape or form balls deep into a video store because I would stay right by the door and I'd wait for my family, flip my lid. Probably would feel uneasy in a video store now as an adult, but so that's why I'm scared of video stores. Uh, it's not because of Timmy the Tooth. Timmy the Tooth is a fond memory, but almost exactly the same thing. I would think that they look similar. I feel like they're in the same category of un uncanny, but I, I think Timmy the Tooth looks fine. I think the cavity goon looks fine. 
Looking at you, Ed Eddie Burback. Scared of the cavity goon. He makes funny faces. What a cutie. I love it. But no, I'm I'm absolutely still to this day terrified of Jack Frost and I can't get over it. I'm gonna have to have a friend like scribble out his face for when I put him in the in the video. And that's why uh, I never went into video stores. Um, eventually my parents would just sit out in the car with me while my siblings went in and like grabbed a video and like rented it for like the weekend. I remember there was a commercial for Jack Frost on the beginning of our Scooby-Doo The Hex Girls um, VHS tape and I'd always wait out the commercial but I'd always wait too long and then I'd come in like halfway throughout the movie. I had to make sure because my siblings would always call me back in in the middle of the commercial and freak me out so then I wouldn't be able to trust them. Nobody respects my fear. Like my neighbor will make a snowman in my front yard when I'm not expecting it every single year. That freaks me out. Like everyone, okay, so people can go around being afraid of clowns like it's nobody's business. Like people be like, oh yeah, totally. Clowns are very scary. But then we let these uncanny snow beings just be out and about doing shenanigans. I just don't understand. Why do people have to at me for this? Um, I'm scared of video stores and Jack Frost and not of Timmy the Tooth and I'm proud. Not that proud. <laughs> Really should have done my makeup more before doing this video. All right, everyone, that's all I got to say about that. A little bit embarrassing. That's why I'm afraid of video stores. All right, everyone, like this video if you did. Don't if you didn't. Subscribe to me. You'll get more of me. All right, everyone, have a wonderful day. Bye-bye. All right, everyone, have a good day. Bye-bye.